Hello everyone, and welcome back to Terranigma. Alright, we've got a ship now, so let's use it. First and foremost, um, we should probably head back across the seas to... Law and Litz. There's a whole bunch of stuff we can do now that we've got the ship, and, well, we might as well do it now. Um, that's Litz. Um, let's go to Law first. The Balkans. In Litz, we took some scenery photos. Whoops. Alright, now if I can remember, head to Great Britain. Riches. This is super wealthy magnet Sir Rich's mansion. Sir Rich is a self-centered, but self-rich is self-centered, but people like his generosity. Is that him there? I believe so. Don't let his appearance fool you. He is a shrewd judge. Hmm, interesting. I am rich. If I may say so, I am super rich. I wish to decorate, but I can't find a thing worthwhile. Have a suggestion? Money is no object. As I said, I am super rich. What is that painting? It is fantastic. I want it. I care not about the price. It's yours. Sure, it's yours. It's by Matisse, who lives in the law. Is that right? I will hang... I'll hang it right away. This is my thanks. A thousand gems. I think it would be a shame if I alone enjoyed this much talent. As super rich for the arts, I shall aptly support his artistic efforts. I ask that you inform... who was it? Matisse for me? Okay, I will. I'll do exactly that. But, shortly. <gasps> a little dog. Arf, arf, arf. I want a little dog. Um, let's just stop by Loire while we're close. Or Loire. I keep thinking of Noir. I don't know. There you go. Listen, listen. A person recognized my talent. He says he's going to support me as much so I can paint as much as I want, but I'm happy because someone liked my paintings enough to do this. I'm gonna do my best for the people who like my paintings. You do that, buddy. Art isn't easy. People like to think it is, but you know, a good picture, even a small one, takes at least an hour. Get out of the way, Madam Papillo. You are nasty. Oh, they are gone. My workers have all left me. What has entered their minds? Give some to my lady friend. <laughs> well, I got tired of hard liquor. Since I gave you that wine, more people have come looking for it. I'm too busy to keep up with demand. A 
I came to study here because I heard they made a fantastic drink. I get so many orders, it's hard just keeping up. Sweet. Okay, it's all going well. What else did we have to do here? Oh, she's got her own place now. Marilee's. We left Madam's shop so we can help Marilee. After I gave you those clothes, I started getting many orders. I can now run my own boutique. You're welcome! <laughs> the Tourist Bureau provides information on travel in other cities. Many people can learn of other lands through us, but we don't have enough information on other lands. If you have photos of other lands, I'd love to see them. Um, I don't think we have enough just yet. But we will soon! Yeah, not ready to upgrade just yet, but it will be very shortly. Okay, there's a few things we can do now. Wait. Ooh. I don't remember this place. A caravan. We desert merchants set up camp. Buy goods and sell them while moving. Do you wish to buy? Yep, what are you selling? Best armor, bronze pike. It's a bunch of crap, really. Ooh, a crystal. I'll buy one of those. Never trust the desert. Many have tri have died in its harsh sands. They become merely bleached bones in the middle of the desert. Man, having a boat really helps with discovery. I know exactly what to do with that crystal too. We might need nine though, so I'm a little bit worried. Might have to do that a little bit later. Um, is there anything else we can do around here? Creepy. Ooh. Nice. Just a thousand bucks sitting in the desert. Okay. Is that it? Like. Didn't mean to leave. <laughs> Can we talk to any of the gravestones? Nope. Damn it! Oh well, whatever. Screw it! At least I know where I can get crystals. Cape Town. That's actually a nod to um, Illusion of Gaia, because South Cape is the town you start in, so you start in South Africa. Arabia. Oh, we can go to Australia, maybe. Oh, what is this? Oh, I'm going that way. Speed shoes. Seems like a strange item to randomly get on an island somewhere. And 300 bucks.
Nothing. Ooh, an item. I like items. Treasure? Oh, heck yes. Give me that money. Ooh, a luck potion. I'm gonna use that right away. Oh, we can look at this. Speed shoes. Run like the wind wearing these. Interesting. Seems like we need to equip them there. Nothing. Cool. Ah, uh, Australia. The land I call home. We'll come to you shortly, buddy. There's Neo Tokyo. Oh, another town. You know what? I'm not really ready to go there, but I will do this. In Yongkau, Ark took scenery photos. Sweet. Actually, I'll have a look around for secrets. Because I like secrets. I like to think secrets like me. Really? Nothing? Okay, then. Alright, two more stops before we go to Australia. Polynesia, one of the uh, secret islands that are completely optional to unlock. Friend, you came here expecting a fancy resort, didn't you? The ultimate luxury is relaxing where nothing can disturb you. It's nice in the tropical sun. Wanna catch a nap? Sure. Pleasant dreams, but don't sleep that long. Oh, toasted. <laughs> Ark was crispy toasted. His march rate went up 10 points. Nice. Wow, that's it. I guess that's it. Yep, yep, that is in fact it. Wait, can I take a photo there? I cannot. Okay, there's another island around here somewhere. It's not on the map. There it is. The Island of Mu from Illusion of Gaia. left the right path this time. It is not! Can't take tourism photos in Mu either. I want that treasure. I want it. Oh, I want that treasure too. I want all of the treasure. Five treasure. Ooh, the Enbu Pike. Um, let's have a look if that's any good. Immediately. Ooh, it's a special one. And it is better. Changes defense into strength. I don't know if that's good. <laughs> Ooh, defense boost potion. Look at the strength mirror now that I've got the Enbu thing equipped. Nice. 
nice. I'll probably use a little bit more um, defense, to be honest, though. And there's four special armors and four special weapons in the game. And I do plan to get them all. But this island moo, completely optional, so have a chance to just miss that. It's New Zealand! That's where the hobbits live. Oh, I want to get in there. Apparently I can get in there. I'm gonna get in there. Maybe there's a secret. How do we get in there? <laughs> there it is. Sail around them reefs, boy. Sweet. Where's all the Maoris at? Ooh, I'll take that. Meiji rock. Anything over here? There is not. Well, I guess that was for nothing. Well, not for nothing, I got a magic rock, but still, it's New Zealand, come on, got to, there should have been something there, like, maybe a little village or something? I don't know. Either way, it's finally time to go home. Also, there's no Tasmania. Imagine there's a continent here, so between this, oh, or an island, I should say. Imagine this little straightway here, that would have been where I nearly fell to my death when I was a little kid. Yes, give me that money, boy. Oh, I guess it was just some money. That's alright, I like money. It was a lot of money. Pretty sure the max is 99,999. Sweet, more secrets. Left or right? Uh, I'm gonna choose left. Please don't be the wrong one. It's gonna be the wrong one, knowing my luck. <sighs> yep. Super knees. Well, two treasures. Ooh, life potion and another bit of money. Hell yeah. Let's go to, um, Ayers Rock, that's what it used to be called. It's called Uluru now. Our indigenous, what people call Aborigines, what we call First Australians, won the legal right to rename Ayers Rock to Uluru. And good for them, they deserve to. It's, it's, they were living here first. Oh, pretty. Take. I cannot. Nothing. Nothing at all. Nothing. Nothing. Tra la la. Alright. I just don't think we're supposed to be there yet. 
more secrets. <sighs> not yet. I think I know where that goes, but we're not going to do it yet. I'm going to go here first. The Sun Coast. Ah, oh, I grew up on the Sunshine Coast. There's a stinky little koala. We call them drop bears, because they've got two thumbs and razor-sharp claws, and they drop out of the trees and slice you to shreds. I'll leave if this town is turned into a tourist attraction. Well, strap in, buddy. Because Australia is about as tourist attraction-y as you can get. The tropical sun sets the heart of men and women on fire. Great place. If you like living three quarters of a mile from the surface of the sun, um, yeah, maybe. I came here from a boat from Litz. This is a nice town. This is the oasis of my soul. I'm going to keep it a secret. It's a nice place. Coming here with another guy. Oh, get over it. Or if anything, get onto it. Hey. Ah, tourism. I think I already did that. Oh, you have photos from any places. May I see them? Sure. Form on law. Form on Litz. Form on freedom. Form on Mer Lake. Oh, you don't want to see Leotto or Young Cow, huh? It's just TKO. Coconut juice. Yuck, I hate coconut juice in real life. This tastes nasty. I like bounties, though. The sun feels great. Heaven. That's what they say on TV, but seriously, summer here blows. Isn't this a nice place? We don't get many visitors, so it's quiet. The leaders are apparently trying to attract more visitors. Well, that's where I come in. Welcome! What do you sell? Ooh, a new thing. Holy water. Thunder pike? I don't have one of them. That's not as good as what I got, though. And since I can buy it, there's no point in grabbing it, really. I need to save my room for things that I can't buy. To the west of the Sunshine Coast is a huge stone mountain named Azrock. A scientist there said he was going to observe the end of Earth. The world is so peaceful, and yet we still have disturbed people. <laughs> yeah, we've got a lot of them, unfortunately. People don't come here because we're an island, if we had access. This town has many attractions. The food is great, the koalas are cute, but we don't get many visitors. I wonder what's wrong. We hold meetings every day for promotion, for promoting our village worldwide. People that come by boat get to look, get to like this village. Oh, yeah. What are the men yakking about all day long? I would rather not see many strangers coming to this quiet place. Ooh, the sea house. Welcome, all you can eat, seafood smorgasbord, 15 bucks. We take pride in our low prices. It's a lie. Everything costs super lo lots here, super lots. Everything is very expensive here. Terra Enigma, when it came out on Super Nintendo, was a hundred bucks. Oh, all that's left is to go up. Okay, there's a house.
Kynes there. I believe that's Kynes. Keynes? Keynes. I think my beef is the best in the world. I wonder how I could let the whole world know about my beef. Can you advertise for me? Sure. A single bite is worth a thousand words. I'll give you a sample. Give this to somebody who can appreciate the sample. Ah, there's that dude in um, Freedom who makes anything he eats famous. So we're going back to Freedom. That's kind of what we need to do anyway. Because that's where the storyline takes us. But we're done with here for now. I do need to stop by in Lior to drop off the tourism photos, and I need to go south to Antarctica. South Pole. Time to find us the treasure of the mermaids. Oh, okay, we're not supposed to do that, I guess. A life potion. Ooh, the sea mail. I will equip that. Oh, it's a special one. Hell yeah. Well, that was quick. Oh, there's another area we can go in. I didn't know. There would be a place this dry at the South Pole. Huh? These look like tombstones. Why this extreme edge of the world? Looks like some sort of altar. Creepy. I think I might remember what it's for though, but yeah. Creepy. Creepy. Asterica, ah. There appears to be nothing in the goblet. Oh, that's that place where people do rituals to get closer to God. Guess we're not meant to do that yet. And I'm okay with that, because that's... eerie. Alright, let's head back up to freedom. Oh wait, I was going to head over to Lore, hand in these tourism photos first. Because I'm pretty sure that's the last thing we need to do to um, advance Lore a little bit more. We might be a little bit over time with this episode, but bear with me. Oh, one other thing I can do as well that I remembered. just done a whole bunch of sightseeing ever since we grabbed the ship. This has been a whole episode of sightseeing. Here we go, crafts. Hello, you have something nice there, that sparkling stone. May I have it? Sure. Sure, take it. I'm generous. 
Thank you. It gives me the feeling I'll make something good. I got this idea from the crystal you gave me. Good. the tourism place. There it is. Oh, that's right, I unequipped it. Let's Freedom, no lake, sun cursed. Sweet. I think that's good. I think that's it. That's alright, we'll come back. But for now, we need to head to freedom and give that man the tasty meat from Australia. I'm Sturma, and I'm the gourmet everyone in town knows. Bring me food that delights me, and I will reward you. Alright, here you go. Eat some of this. Oh hey, you have something that looks delicious. I'm a gourmet. Let me have a sample. Sure, you want some? It's beef from the Sun Coast. Sun Coast, huh? Haven't heard much about that place. Let me try. Hmm. The appearance is extremely appealing. Pass. <laughs> Aroma is also not unpleasant. Pass. Mmm. This tastes great. Pass. I stoma give it my vote of confidence. This will become popular. I must reward you for your most delicious gift. Here, take this. Hundred bucks. Thanks, buddy. Um, the tourism place. Is there a tourism place here? Alright, that's where Perel lives. Where is the bar? There it is. Sucks, dude. Bell's still all messed up. He is Alexander Graham Bell, by the way. No, I didn't mean to go to Stoma's. Um, check the lottery quickly. Alright, well, I guess we should call that an episode there. So if you guys like what you saw, like, comment, and subscribe. Ring that notification bell to stay up to date with episodes, and until next time, you've been watching Soul Blazer 3, Terra Enigma on Dude Go Back. Thanks for watching everyone. <laughs>